next, we're gonna head over to a brand that pretty much everyone knows, it's DJI. And we're gonna go talk to Kyle with DJI. So we've seen him in webinars and he's gonna give us a little bit of background on the products they have here today. So my name is Kyle Miller. I'm an enterprise solutions engineer at DJI. We've got a couple really cool products that we want to showcase here at Commercial UAV Expo. So when we're talking about autonomous capture, one of the main things that we did cap that we did bring in is going to be our new DJI Dock 3. This alongside the Matrice 4 Dock series, we have a thermal version inside the, the dock here. That's really going to be able to help out with repeated missions of the exact same site that you're going to be able to repeat daily, weekly, monthly on whatever occurrence you need. From there, we have the thermal payload that's high resolution if you're trying to do inspections or if you want more of the mapping and 3D modeling capabilities, you can utilize our 4 thirds inch sensor on the M4D. Ooh. And also, could you tell me about some of the other products you brought here today? Sure. So alongside of that, we also were able to bring along some software pieces. That's going to be the new Smart 3D Capture as well as the new Smart 3D Explorer. Those are on the Matrice 4 Enterprise series. You'll be able to capture all sides of your asset to be able to process those into a high resolution 3D model. Beyond that, some of the other things we brought would be the larger drone with the Matrice 350. When we're looking specifically at the payloads, that's gonna be our new H30T. That's gonna have our high resolution thermal camera as well as a high resolution optical zoom. The optical zoom is 34 times optical, all the way up to 400 times digital. So if you're trying to find uh, lost suspects or read license plates, if you're trying to do inspections safely off the asset, but do very small inspections, that's where you're gonna wanna utilize the H3T. If it's more for documentation purposes and making 2D maps, 3D models, even capturing LiDAR, that's where we're gonna go with our tried and true L2 as well as our P1, our full frame photometry sensor. And also, could you tell me about maybe some of your favorite features or maybe some things that people don't necessarily know about with DJI? Yeah, so a lot of the new features and a lot of things that people haven't gotten into as much is gonna be data capture. So we released a Manifold 3, as well as our new obstacle sensing module that's gonna be able to help you fly safely as well as be able to generate 3D models in real time. So you can automate capture down to only three feet away from the asset, looking at sub millimeter quality imagery to be able to process with that. So if you haven't ever tried out some of those 3D model flight plans, we would really highly recommend it. And is that one that people have been mounting on the Matrice 4, the Manifold 3? Yes. So the Manifold 3 is something that we now support. Just as of last week, we re-support that on the Matrice 4 platform. It also works on the new Matrice 400 series to give you more onboard compute power. Cool. Awesome. Perfect. Thank you.